we're getting ready to go see our son graduate the army basic training. I'm on the plane for the first time ever. I'm really nervous. I took a Valium that my doctor gave me. Let's hope it works. Say hi, babe. Hi, babe. We're doing this. Atlanta. We're in a rent a car. It's pretty fancy. Brand new. In the AC because it's hot here. It's hot, hot, hot. So, plane ride was not bad at all. Anybody that's never flown or is scared of flying, I've never flown. Sounds crazy, right? Being 41, never flown. And it wasn't that bad. Um, it wasn't bad at all. So, don't overthink it, just do it. Ain't nothing to it but to do it. Right. <laughs> so we are going to get something to eat because we stood in line for two and a half hours to get our rent-a-car, even though we already booked it. It was crazy here. Um, so yeah, we're gonna go get something to eat. Here we are, we are out of here. I'll check in with you later. DeAndre, here we come. His graduation's tomorrow at 9 a.m. for the Army Basic. Welcome to Georgia, where it was like 90 degrees a little bit ago, and now there's thunderstorms. It's like we drove into a thunderstorm and a lightning. People are driving with their hazards on, like... This is crazy. You want to get over, Ben? Yeah. Follow the hazards, people. Follow I guess in hazards. Georgia, they turn their hazards on. Yeah, your wipers can't even keep up with the rain. This is crazy. Literally, guys, it's hot out and it's literally pouring down rain. Close my mind. Hey guys, we are outside the motel. We are going to see our son. I'm so excited. Are you excited? Yeah, yeah, yes. yeah. We look good, we feel good, and we're excited. I got a little summer dress on with a little jean jacket. Hubby looks shaved and cute. Oh, you won't see that too often. Take a good look. <laughs> Super excited, guys. Getting in the car. Oh, so currently it is, what time is it here? 8, 8.15 or something in the morning. And it looks gloomy as heck. And it's what 80 something 80 degrees out. 80 degrees outside at 8 in the morning and it literally if I can describe it people always say it's so humid down south so some of you are not from down south I could tell you it feels like you're walking into like a steamy bathroom you know when you walk into a bathroom that's steamy and you're just like you feel it on your skin that's how it feels walking outside it feels like a steamy warm bathroom kind of weird Anyways, hopefully I'll get sauna. some footage of my son. It's a sauna. Maybe daddy will film me seeing my son and bawl my eyes out. I don't know. Well, maybe if you, yeah. <laughs> he might be bawling his eyes out too. Shut up. Not so a lot. we'll see. But I'm really excited. It's so weird, you guys. When you don't, my kids are grown, right? Jeremy's grown, DeAndre's grown, my daughter in law, Nessa's grown, Ian's grown. They're all grown. But. I'm around them constantly. They live by me. I see them all the time. I involve myself in their lives and all their special events. And even though they can drive me nuts sometimes and we need a break, it does not mean that they are not my number one priority. Even though we're grown and yeah, we can go live our best lives, we miss our kids when we don't see them. Like, I don't think I can go more than about a week without seeing my kids or I start to struggle. So I haven't seen my son in a few months and he's not even coming home with us. He has to stay, but we get to see him for three days. So I'm going to take advantage of it. It got me on a plane. It got me here. And now I want to take more trips because I realize a plane is not that bad. So it's all a plus. It's all a plan. And that's the plan of life. So I will take you through the day if I can, if they allow me to.
is him. First Army Patterson will lead the troop in the sight of Soldier's Creek. We invite all the buildings off limits to families, so please do not try to enter any of the building doors. At the front of the building, you can sign your soldier and up to one battle buddy out at the table located in front of the building entrance. Have a safe and enjoyable weekend. Please have your soldiers back to this building and report to CQ no later than 8 p.m. Friday and Saturday night. No later than 4 p.m. Sunday evening. Soldiers can be signed out at 8 a.m. Saturday and Sunday morning. If you have any questions, please ask any of the troop captain. Thank you for your attendance. I got my baby, guys. We got our baby. I don't know if my braid looks His right. His voice is running good? out. Look at my handsome baby. Oh, it's sunny. Hard to see. What did they do to your phone before you guys came out? Yeah. Look at them. Okay. We're just missing your brother and Ness and Ian and the twins. <laughs> yeah. I told Jeremy maybe on the next one. Let's go. Let's get the win October. Waffle House. That's where you wanted to go. Fixing his beret. Always fixing his beret. Here, I'll just hurt. A little bit. Yeah. Right one. Right one. Right one. Waffle House don't play. Hey guys, we're just trying to get a tan, me and the hubby. DeAndre's upstairs chilling, sleeping, snacking, whatever. It was nice to see him. We got to FaceTime his brother Jeremy, and we got to call his brother Ian, and they got to talk to him. I sent pictures to all his family, so it was nice. My husband's in the pool. <laughs> I gotta see this. I missed his cannonball. <laughs> he just cannonballed in the pool. The pool is nice. It's a salt water pool. It feels good. In Washington, we get mostly rain. We don't get too much sun, so this is nice. Nice change of pace. Yep. So, yeah. It's going good. I know I haven't been on here much. Um, you, you guys know I got sick. That was my last video. And literally right before I came here, I just started to feel better. We had 4th of July, and I was just starting to feel better. And then we came here. So, 
Sorry you guys haven't seen a video up for me, but I'm good and I'm here. And um, I'm just happy to see my son and spend some time with him. So yeah, we'll check back in later. I love you guys. Thanks for watching. Thanks for supporting and thanks for supporting my kids always. You guys are so kind. My son got his new $180 army boots. <laughs> looking good, looking good. Because they give you some raggedy boots to train in. My husband got his new $35 sweatshirt. Daddy got his proud army dad sweatshirt on. <laughs> looking good, babe, looking good. I got a proud army mom t-shirt. It's kind of big. They didn't have my size, but I'm going to tie it in a knot. It's super cute. Bam. There we go. We're sporting. We're representing. We should have got your... We should have got Ness and Jeremy. Proud sister and proud brother, but... If they come in... If they come in October. There's my handsome son. Aww. He's so cute. Those look nice on you, son. Yeah. So we let him eat his snacks, have his beer, chill in bed today. He didn't have no beer. And, um, oh, he didn't have no beer. And then now, this good old Georgia weather, we're about to go to the Hibachi Grill, and it's currently like 90 degrees outside and raining and oh, thundering. it's only 83. Oh, 83. 83 and rainy so it's like a hot shower outside weird because we literally just came in from the pool I'm sunburnt and um, yeah my hair is curly and wet from the pool I'm in a tank top dress it's hard to see but I'm in it and it's raining now it's so weird this weather is very weird not used to it but I ain't mad at it because now I got a good tan <laughs> all right there's my handsome son. Where's your beret? And we are about to go to the hibachi grill, and then we got to drop him off. He's got to be back by, was it? 8 o'clock. 2000. 8 o'clock. 8 o'clock. So, yeah, we're going to get him back after we eat, and we'll see you tomorrow. Breakfast. We are at... Cracker Barrel. I've never been here, but I've heard good things about it, and my son wanted to go. We got him again. <laughs> so, yeah, we'll see. They have homemade biscuits. Buttermilk biscuits. Really good, son? I haven't tried it yet. Oh, you got to try it. He's putting honey on his. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Buttermilk biscuits. You eat them in the morning, you eat them at night. Eat them with something that's dinner just right. <laughs> What'd you get, son? Cheesecake bakers. Cheesecake stuffed pancakes. That looks good. Cool. They got country fried steak, eggs, and the Cracker Barrel cheesy stuffed hash browns with gravy. I got a sample breakfast. Cracker Barrel hash browns. Sausage, bacon, eggs. Yummy. Tarjay. To get this boy some swim trunks and some slides. Because we need some water. It's 98 degrees out here right now, and it's only like 11 a.m., 10 a.m. What time is it? Not even 10 a.m. My son has never seen himself in the mirror. Is that crazy? They don't have mirrors. My poor baby. <laughs> this is my outfit of the day. Tie-dye, of course. Shorts. And my tie-dye vans. So, yeah, yeah, yeah. This is a pineapple refresher, and those are a cookie crumble mocha something. Mocha cookie crumble. Yeah. Oh.
Hey guys, we're just at the pool cooling off because what else is there to do? It's hot as heck and we are in Columbus, Georgia. We did some sightseeing, as you see, we went to the museum, ate. All my son really wants to do is eat and kind of lounge and hang out and swim and stuff, which is understandable, so much obliged. And then I just gotta get back to it when I get home. <laughs> Anyways, just checking in. It's a beautiful day. You guys, look at these tan lines. Just like daddy, like, like what is it? Like father, like son? <laughs> they both got the tan line. I'm dead. Oh, he's sleeping. Hey guys, we're getting ready to go to somewhere where he wanted to go, uh, Siriano's Brick Oven Wood-Fired Pizza. So that's where we're going. I gotta get back to it. <laughs> Anyways, look at this shirt. This is what I wanted to show you. It says, I once protected him. Now he protects me. And it's got the little army tags and it's like a mom thing, army mom. Super cute. I think it's super cute. I mean, it's really big. This is the only size I had, but I just <coughs> tucked it on the side right there and just kind of let it hang. It's fine. It's cute. Can you see? Yes. So this is my little outfit. I'm short. It's hard to see. Army mom. What's crazy is I never wanted him to go in the army. I never wanted any of my kids to go in the army. I told him I would lock them in the trunk and drive them out to the woods. And you can't force your kids to do what you want them to do. You gotta let them live their lives and make the best choices they can. So I got one son that chose a father life as being a super great dad and hubby. And I got one son that chose the army life and as being a super great leader and army guy. And that's all that matters. Right? Right. Right. <laughs> we'll see you at the pizza place. Look at this, guys. Ooh, it's hot, hot. Brick oven pizza. Looking good. This is a spicy Hawaiian. Oh, and she got a meat lover coming. Thank you so much. Pull it out, Daddy. Is it good, son? Yeah. That looks good. Huh? Oh, yeah. The cheese pull. Look at the cheese pull. Holy moly. <laughs> Dropping them off. Turning them back in. He's got to be here by 8. 20 minutes early. And then we'll take him again tomorrow for his last visit day before we leave. And he goes to AIT training, job training, and they'll be giving him a station soon. You what? Hey guys, it's early, early. We're going to get DeAndre for our last visit day. We get to check him out and have him back by 4 p.m. today. So he'll probably want to go to breakfast. I'm so bloated. <laughs> I'm so full. Um, yeah, I don't know. <clears throat> I'm glad this is the last day. I'm not used to eating. Like, I eat every day. I eat a lot of food. You guys know that. But it's my kind of food. I'm not used to eating you know, pizza and stuff like that, heavy food. So I've been drinking tons of water. I'm actually eating prunes just to kind of keep digestive working and trying to eat fruit, you know, every day a couple fruits. So just to, you know, keep the tummy calm. But this is what I'm wearing. Little Walmart shoes. Cute little sunflower dress or daffodil dress, whatever it is from Walmart. And yeah, my hair's up because it's hot. Here it is like 7.30 in the morning and it's already 82 degrees. So, she cute, she cute, she cute. All right, see you. There he is. 
I've got to adjust his beret. It's like the rule. Hey, son. Good morning, sir. <laughs> it's so funny when they're walking out of Justin. Hey, we're going to eat. My baby wants chicken. So he's getting chicken. Look how handsome he is. I love it. Getting hot, hot, hot. We're getting ready to go to the movie. He's suiting back up because he's not allowed to wear his, um, what do you call it? Regular, like, slides and basketball shorts. Not allowed to wear it out in public. He can go to the pool, but that's about it. So, Georgia, Georgia, it's so dang hot in Georgia. All right, we ready? I'm about to eat a Georgia peach. Yeah, Georgia dark. My handsome man. Two of them. Two of them are here out of all four Microphone of them. Check one, two. Microphone check, 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 check. <laughs> all right, we'll see you after the movie. What are we going to see? Top, Top, Gun, Top two. Gun 2. The new one with Maverick. They both have Maverick on the charge. Oh. Hey guys, we're out of the movie. Really good movie. I didn't think I was going to care for it. What was it called again? Tom Cruise Maverick? What was it called? Top Gun. Top Gun Maverick. And like the old Top Gun from what, 86? So, um, but this is the new one. Really good. I was on the edge of my seat the whole time. It's got like love story in it, it's got action, it's got heart, it's really good. Make you tear up a little bit, really good movie. Highly recommend Top Gun, the new one, in theaters, or out of theaters now, I don't know, in some places. So yeah, we're back in the Georgia heat. It's hot out here. I think we're going to head back to the room and swim, I'm not sure. But I will let you know what we do. All right, guys, he ate his last yummy meal, and we are getting ready to leave and drop my baby back off for until October. October, he'll be done with AIT, and he'll be stationed somewhere, hopefully at home, but we don't know. So, yep, this is the end of the road from my baby. You might see us back on the plane if I decide to vlog it. I get a little weird on the plane, but it was not that bad of a plane ride. I will say that to anybody that's scared of flying like I was. It wasn't that bad. Do you want to say bye to my YouTube fam? Bye, bye. to your family if they're watching. I love everybody. Uh, I love everybody. And yeah, I'll be back soon. And he'll be back soon. Love you guys. Okay, he's gone. <laughs> there he goes, into that building. Actually, they're in the back of the building forming up to probably do push-ups or something. <laughs> All right. We'll see him in October. He's officially in the army. <laughs> He's officially a soldier. He's guys. officially a soldier. It's crazy. I didn't want him to be a soldier. I told all my kids I'd lock them in the trunk if they became soldiers or even tried to join the army. And now I'm very proud of them. All right, guys. We are going to go back to the room. Probably take a dip and then pack up. That way we can wake up and be ready tomorrow to hop on a plane. Atlanta airports are crazy, so I don't know if I'll be filming because we get lost very easily in that airport. So, we'll see. But, yeah. I don't know. Thank you guys for watching. Um, if I come back, I come back. If I don't, love you guys.